What's up guys? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you 10 cool websites that will blow your mind. And these are websites that you probably didn't even know were real. So let's check them out. Okay, so website number one is called How Secure Is My Password? And this website will basically just tell you how long it would take your password to get hacked. So I'll just start with something simple like password. And it'll say that this is gonna be cracked instantly. Now you could put in something much harder and it will tell you a thousand years. So that's a pretty dang long time. So this password will work just fine. And before we move on to the next website, uh, something interesting I found with this one is if you just keep typing in random things, it'll keep jumping up. And honestly, I don't even know how to pronounce the number of years that these are. And it just keeps on going. What is a Tres Vigentilian year? That's a lot of freaking years. And if you just keep typing, it just gets more and more obnoxious. <sighs> Website number two is called This Is Why I'm Broke. And it's just a place where you can buy random products that you may or may not need, like bulletproof men's underwear, or shoe condoms, or this tank for your cat, or this Nicolas Cage bikini. But there's also some cool products on there, like this all-terrain scooter, or maybe a giant water slide. But this site has a lot of interesting stuff, so I recommend just playing around in here and see what you can find. Uh, good luck on your wallet. Okay, website number three is called Will Robots Take My Job? And it's pretty simple. All you do is just put in your job and it will tell you whether robots are eventually going to take it over or not. So in this case, I'll just put web developer and you can just select it from down here. So I'll do web developers and there's a 21% chance that this is going to happen. And if you scroll down, it'll say there's a small chance that this occupation will be replaced by robots. Uh, it'll say that there's a 37% chance within the next two decades. So still 37% is not too bad. It'll even tell you whether you need to worry or not. So I'll show you a different one. So if I put in, say, taxi driver, and then select it here, there's an 89% chance that this is gonna be taken over by robots. And it'll even tell you that robots are watching this. And it will also tell you the annual wage for this job. <sighs> Website number four is called PhotoP. And it's basically just an online Photoshop. So if you don't wanna pay $20 a month for Photoshop, this is a dang good replacement. So you've got brush tools, just like Photoshop, you can control Z just like Photoshop, and you've got selection tools, pretty much every tool that you have with the actual Photoshop program. And you can even save files out as PSDs and then someone else can open them up in Photoshop. And you can also save them as GIMP files, RAW files, and more. I really wish I knew about this one like seven years ago. <sighs> Website number five is called Madian FR Adventure Machine. And Madian is a musical artist and this is a beat board that you can mix beats with. So first you select drums, then a voice, and then a synth. So I'll show you how it works. <laughs> Website number six is called Time. And this will tell you exactly how long it would take you to binge watch certain TV shows. So I'll just type one in here, like friends, and then just select it from the drop down, and then just click on go. And it will take approximately three days, 14 hours, and 32 minutes if you watched friends from season one, episode one, to the last episode of season 10, all the way through without stopping. <sighs> Website number seven is called Web Oasis and it's just a replacement that you can use for your web browser homepage. So what you can do is search in Google up here, or you've got hot links down below, like say if you wanna to go to Spotify or SoundCloud or so on. There's also Reddit, Twitter, all the helpful buttons that you need right up here. Or you can take notes over here on the left, or you can go into the menu over here and you can even play around in an arcade like this. Or if you go back to the menu, you can even edit photos by going to the editor and you can edit all your photos here and save them. 
Or if you go back to the menu again, you can even change the background. So if you go to change background down here, you can just select any one of these down below. Or you can even add a custom one. So if you want this to come up every time you open Chrome or Firefox, just save this page as your default homepage for your web browser. <sighs> website number eight is called rave.dj. This website allows you to mash up two songs into one, or you can create full playlists. But if you wanted to mash up two songs into one, you just click on the mix it up button, and you'll see mash up two songs together here, and then you can just search for the songs here. Now, a lot of the ones that you make are not gonna be great at first. Uh, I mashed up several before I found two that even work, but two that I found to work were Juicy by Biggie Smalls, and then you can just select the video here from YouTube, so I'll just do the explicit version because that's way more fun. And then I'll also do Tiny Dancer by Elton John. And then I'll grab the lyric video because music videos tend to have intros and outros on them. And then all you have to do is click Create Mashup. Website number nine is called zoomquilt.org, and it's just an endless string of artwork that's all tied together the more you keep zooming in. So if you use the up arrow, you can go faster, or if you use the back arrow, you can come back out again. But the more you keep going, the more artwork keeps appearing, and it's incredibly trippy, and I don't think there's actually an end to it. And you can even get more artwork over here by clicking on this little button and clicking on another one. So feel free to have fun with this one, but if you're prone to seizures, then I would definitely advise against it. And last but not least, website number 10 is called Stool Analyzer. And this is a website where you can actually analyze the healthiness of your poo and see if you're actually eating the right diet. So to get started, just click on Start Analysis. And I'm just gonna select some fake poo. So first you wanna select the shape. So let's say like a sausage. And we'll scroll down and select a color. So we'll just do some normal poo, like medium brown. And then the size. So too small, ideal, or too large. Let's do maybe too large. And then the frequency at which you make bowel movements. So you've got four or more, three bowel movements a day, or less than two. So I'm just going to select something like three. And then you'll also select the behavior. Is it floating? or sinking slowly or rapidly sinking. So I'll just do rapidly sinking. And it's telling me that my poo is excellent. Uh, and it'll actually give you some facts about this type of poo. So it'll tell you that the ideal poo is about 2.54 centimeters. And it'll tell you that anything larger than that will indicate constipation. So feel free to use this website and analyze your poo habits and see if you're healthy. All right, guys, so I hope you found some of these websites interesting. And if there's any that I missed, then feel free to drop those in the comments below, and I will totally check them out. And if you want to see more videos like this, then feel free to hit that subscribe button on my channel. Much appreciated. All right, see you on the next video.